What's up, YouTube? It's Eric, and Lions fan. Thanks for clicking on this video. Just wanted to do a little bit of Detroit Lions update. I know they've been free agency started in the NFL and all that, but I kind of wanted to make a uh, video of, uh, it's probably just going to be a short video, uh, that the Detroit Lions cut DeAndre Levy. And I've been thinking this over and whatnot, and kind of how, how I want to say it and what I'm going to say, but I think it's a, probably a good move by the Lions. He only started five games in the last two years, and he just wasn't the same player that he was. Um, his speed his speed went down quite a bit. We thought he was going to be a major component of the Lions when we drafted him, but it just didn't work out because of his uh, injuries and all that and how his social, not, not to say that his social status or social what he did outside of the NFL was anything bad. It's just that maybe the Lions and DeAndre Levy didn't mesh well. And the injuries didn't help either, let's just say that. Because he had a knee injury and then he had a hip injury uh, that both uh, required surgery to get, I believe is what I read on the Detroit Free Press site. Um, but it just just didn't, It's not didn't, the marriage wasn't good and they had to get divorced, I guess is kind of how you would put it. But it, it, I think in the end it's going to be a good thing. Now we're really thin at linebacker now. We're probably going to have to get a new core group of linebackers in here. Uh, Tamir Whitehead, to me, is kind of an average linebacker. Uh, I didn't think he did. He wasn't really blowing me away at that spot. We're just, we're, the, the big thing is we're really, really thin at linebacker. And I kind of don't want to make excuses for us either, but we, ju we just need a new core, a linebacker core. That, prob that group probably needs to be rebuilt. And I don't know what Bob Quinn's going to do. He's signed a couple of people. Um at the defensive back, the cornerback position, all that, but I haven't really seen much from the linebacker core. But again, I'm not, I don't keep up on uh, the Detroit Lions free agency transactions. And I probably really won't really report on the Detroit Lions on their draft status. I'll let other people do that, like Everything King, Man Beast Morris, uh, Hitman 313, uh, East Warren LB, all those type of guys. They're usually pretty, pretty much up on that stuff. Um, I just, to me, I just don't, I don't necessarily want to say I don't care about that, but it's stuff that doesn't interest me. I'll just put it that way. It just doesn't interest me. Um, I want to see how they do on the field. I could care less who they sign and whatnot. I just want to more or less see how they, how they are on the field and if they're going to help us. Yeah, DeAndre Levy just wasn't, he just wasn't the same player that he was when he came back. Let's, let's just put it that way. And the extension that Mayhew put out there, which was stupid, just... <laughs> just dumb uh, I'm glad Quinn is kind of getting that off the books now he's a June 1st cut uh, I heard Dave uh, Dave Burkett and Tim Twentyman say he's going to be a June 1st cut I guess is what's going to save him quite a bit of money uh, in the long run I guess it's just uh, 1.2 million dollars but the other cuts they're, they're it's starting to compound on itself and hopefully we'll be able to get some guys in here with some talent uh, the Detroit Lions have already made some moves with uh, Hayden and Falls, I guess, <clears throat> are two people that I, I'm apparently they're pretty good. I don't know. I haven't Hayden I've heard of before, but the other guy I have not. Uh, I to be honest, I don't really know what positions they play. Like I said, I don't really know about free agency and all that and what positions they play and if they're good or not because I only follow the lines. So I don't want to make this out to say, yeah, I know every player and what position they play and how well they are, or how they're not. I don't. I don't. I'm just going to trust Quinn that hopefully he's putting in the right pieces in to make us a contender. So, um, Warford went to the Saints and Reef went to the Vikings, which I'm surprised with Reef. I thought we were going to keep Reef around, but apparently the Lions' offer wasn't very lucrative. Apparently, and then he went, so he went to the Vikings. So, um, but apparently a couple people, um, it was kind of to me. I kind of see it was 50-50 with Reef. People liked him, other people didn't. So I don't think it's a big, a big, um, maybe not be a very, a very big loss for the Lions. So, uh, guys, I'm sorry. I've been working outside. I've been, been pretty tired. I just got done doing a beer review here too. Just a long day. I'm just gonna sit back, relax, and then get ready to go out and try to uh, try to shake my booty a little bit. <laughs> but anyway, guys, that's my Detroit Lions update here, real quick. Just something, just a little ramble here about it. Uh, the big thing was Levy getting cut by the Lions. Um, I am actually, as a Detroit Lions fan, glad to see that happen. I didn't think it was, uh, I didn't think it was a good deal to 
extend him in the first place knowing his injury history. So um, that was another stupid ass move by Mayhew that Bob Quinn finally got rectified. So uh, guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Do you like the moves? Do you not like the moves so far? I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent on it. Like I said, I don't necessarily know if the guys that they picked up are good or not only because I'm, I just like to see, I like to watch him play. I'm going to admit, I like to like to watch, I like to watch Lions play. Uh, I don't necessarily know about the free agency moves. I may talk about the draft a little bit, maybe get read a couple articles and then get my assessment on it. I may do that, but other than that, the Detroit Lions news is probably going to be pretty much uh, few and far between on this channel, So, except for when the games come around. So, Anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's stupid, rambling on. I know it's not very good. So, But let me know. Thumbs up, thumbs down if you're indifferent. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope to see you guys again soon. Deuces.